Today is May 5th and it's about 8 o'clock in the morning. Last night we went to sleep around, well we kind of like called it a night around 12 a.m. And I went to sleep around 3 a.m., woke up around 5 a.m. So I got two hours of sleep. I don't know why I can't sleep. This is like so annoying. <laughs> but um, I got up early because I wanted to uh, take my brother out. I've been to Paris before but he hasn't so I want to make the best of it for him, so I'm going to try to, you know, suck it up and go out and take him out and force him to go out and enjoy because I think this is once in a while, once in a blue moon when he actually travels. So um, we don't have any time today to go travel, so we're going to do it early in the morning and get it all out. By the time we head out to the show, it's going to be about 4 p.m., so it's going to be um, not enough time, so we have to start early. I'm getting up right now gonna brush my teeth because I am stinky right now. Head out to sightseeing with my brother. Let's go. Okay guys, I wanna show you guys how crazy retarded my phone is. It's been like, look, it won't even like hang up for the longest time. I can't even do anything and it's been taking me a million years to upload my vlog. It doesn't catch any Wi-Fi. I can't even shut it off if I wanted to. Look at that. It's just volume up, volume down. I can't like if I hold the shutdown button, nothing. It's just so frustrating because it's like I just got this phone. This is an iPhone 10, and it's like, what the heck is going on? It's, ah! I mean, I can go back to the home button, but then here it's kind of like, what's going on? Good morning. What's up, dog? Dude. The sun's out. I said early morning. <laughs> Let's go hang out. I text you at 5.30. In the morning? Your butt didn't even like respond. Oh, shit. I had to call. I had to call him at 8 o'clock. We are tight on schedule. And I don't want you to be complaining about how you didn't do anything in Paris because we we're all singing and don't have enough time. I'll get to sleep. I was just like, I'm gonna go. I'm gonna go. And I was like, whoa. You know, I didn't even sleep till 3 and woke up at 5. Damn. Okay, so since last night I could not sleep, I did a lot of research. It's a tight, tight, short amount of time, so we can't be picky with our food and where we're going. We already hit up the Eiffel Tower. We're probably going to hit up the Notre Dame. Notre Dame. One, either way, tomato, tomato. And uh, get some food. First stop is the baguettes. We're going to go to this place called... I'm not even trying to pronounce it. It's like a place that won um, baguettes two years in a row. 2005 and 2015? I'm not sure. Okay. It's kind of I will show you what it's called when I get there. <laughs> it's called Ashaya. Yes, it's called I'll show you when I get there. Check out the view. Alright, so um, let's head out now and uh, start our day early. Vin's already wasted half a day. It's 9 o'clock right now. Ready to rock and roll, start our day. I'm looking like a hot mess. That's this good. is like day four of no sleep. Zombie mode. <laughs> I got my sleep. I know you did. He's not a team player. <laughs> no, he's not. Here they have hotel breakfast. We are going to skip out and get something else. This is what it looks like. Got some coffee and uh, juices over here. While waiting for Uber, I grabbed myself a baguette from the hotel to compare. I have to have something to compare. Have some, Vin. Try some so we can compare it to the one we're going to right now. Somehow we landed at Moulin Rouge, Red District area. A lot of sex shops. Oh my goodness. We're in the cuts now with our Uber yeah. driver. Where are you taking us? <laughs> Got some jams. There's some cookies, crumpets, some chocolate. Those baguettes. Freshly made. Ooh, look at the line. The line just got much longer. We are in luck. We ordered a baguette and a croissant, butter croissant, and we're gonna test it out and see if it's good. Try it. He just dropped this on the ground, just to let you guys know. Right on the ground. Cheers. <laughs> Cheers. It's alright. What do you think? Oh, it's a croissant in Paris. Nice and crispy, buttery. Kind of oily, huh? The croissants has first prize and third prize. Few competitions for that. Oh yeah, and TripAdvisor stamped. Approved. Uh -huh. 
All right, and our second one is the ham and cheese. Hamon and cheese. We're gonna share this. It's hamon? Yeah, it's huge. Oh my goodness. Gotta Instagram it first. It's a large one. We cannot do one by ourselves. Oh. Let's get fat before I sing. So I'm gonna roll around on stage. Check. <laughs> All right, let's test it out. <laughs> mm. No cheers? <laughs> cheers. Cheers. <laughs> <laughs> Mm. Let's test this out. It's more, it's much more crispier than I thought. Mm. I like it crispy. I like Very it a crispy. little bit more chewy and soft. You like it? I like it. Crispy. Is it award winning? <laughs> um, pretty bomb, dude. It's pretty damn good. I like it. I like that it's small, but I still want it to be a little bit more soft and less crispy. I think it's good. Too much cheese though, actually. Oh, I love the cheese. What are you talking about? Yeah, too much cheese. Mmm. This is good flavor, but I feel like I'm gonna break my my teeth every single bite. Stumbled upon this butchery. That chicken is roasting real good. Juice, juice it up, juice it up. Ooh, oozing, oozing. Here we have uh, the meats, the gooses, the pates. Let's check it out. All the pate right here, or faux gras. I think we need some coffee. We're stopping by for a quick espresso. We're double fisting today. What you got there? This is like the turmeric shot, uh -huh. the cold, and then the espresso shot. Ooh. Hot. So the turmeric is supposed to help him with his gout and everything, hopefully. And I'm gonna have espresso because I didn't sleep all day. This is going to help us survive the day Good. through the night into the night. This is a very cute place. I'm so glad I'm spending it with my brother. My love. Once again, being super extra. Here we go, here we go. <laughs> go ahead, enjoy, enjoy. Instagram it. This shit just comes naturally. When you're in France, you became artistic. Okay, that's his Instagram, guys. What is it, Vin Cudo? Check him out. Vinny Boy 87. Vinny Boy. 187. <laughs> How's that turmeric shot? Yeah. It's like healthy, 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 healthy. It's just like that, um, what, what's that? Uh, that vinegar thing that you do? Apple, Apple cider, cider vinegar. vinegar. <laughs> Get that good. Healthy. Like that. It's that turmeric shot. Ooh. Nice Look to have flowers cool. around. Yeah. He's getting excited over flowers. Yeah, dude. Look at how nice it is. <laughs> That's your girl. Walking down. It's not a girl. All right, right now like we're going to mob the streets right now. Let's go. Check out. It's just like, I, 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 it, it makes me happy. Flowers you make you happy? A, you don't gotta be a girl to be like liking Okay, Vin, and stuff like that. for your that. birthday, I'm gonna get you some flowers. <laughs> I'll be like, coat. <laughs> Walking down the street like, damn, that's a flower. Do you have a favorite flower? Oh, shit. No, I don't got a favorite flower. I just love art. That's like art from the ground. Mm. Especially from the concrete. You are such a Taurus. <laughs> He's gonna buy something for Lynn. I think she might like the uh, pink one right here. This one? I'm assuming. Uh, no, man, if it was like brown. If it was brown? First time in Paris, I was here. In the same spot. <laughs> Dude, who cares about anything now? <laughs> We're gonna figure out what this place is Moulin Rouge. Do you think it's a strip club or a, a bar? Oh no. Let's go find out. So it looks like it's a dinner and a show. I see. So it's not really like strip club. No. Right? Like a whole Moulin Rouge. Mm -hmm. Glimpse of what the show looks like. So a dancing show. And how much is it, Vin? $190. $190. See some boots. <laughs> Two hundred dollars to see some boobs, yeah. semi boobies, French boobies. French boobies. So uh, let's go. <laughs> I'll see you guys tonight. <laughs> Win in Paris. He wants to go see. see this. Oh gosh. You gotta see what they got in Paris. No, I'm not gonna lie. I do check out a lot of sex stores just to look at their this costumes and their craziness. All these like nice uh, accessories for your. Costumes? <laughs> Apparently Vin's looking for a chastity belt. Isn't that what you're doing? Chastity belt? Huh? Yeah. 
Vin, are you satisfied? Yeah. <laughs> I think I think the posters were better than anything else. Or just the the, the outside books I did. These models are good. You use the right models. <laughs> <laughs> oh my goodness, so bad. Let's go. These sex stores that we've been to so far, the owners and the workers seem very chill about it. They don't really give us a weird look and you know, like for me, I'm looking for pantyhose, so Obviously, it's not that intention that I'm looking for a, a chastity belt. <laughs> but yeah, they're very professional and very open about it. It's a city of love. Mm -hmm. Everybody got to do some loving. Yes, they're going to help you get to that loving point. <laughs> and those I who enjoy need. It. We've been searching for some pate and we found it. Let's get some. On a small bread, let's share one. We are at another bakery. This is the Julian Bakery. Oh, heart attack everywhere. And check out this orange machine. Ooh, you throw orange in there, and then you squeeze it out and get fresh orange here. This place doesn't have pate. Boo, only ham and cheese. On to the next one. Boo. We just found a secret market. Interesting, interesting. Let's get lost. Let's get lost in Paris. Oh yeah. Cheese galore right here. Cheese station. Oh, yeah. Then we have olives, some uh, dried foods, nuts, pistachios. This looks like a farmer's market. Everything fresh, set up on the street. Everyone's browsing. Okay, so I'm using some sort of medication to keep my face a little bit lightened from all the dark spots and I need umbrella because the sun is hitting me like no other. We found some umbrellas. Yes. Let's check this one out. Is it cute? It's black. Oh, look at the black rain. Black one or the white one? Oh no, the, the black, black one, one looks pretty nice. But that's the white one. Oh no. I like black. I don't know. <laughs> Everything I like black. I gotta see from far away. Let me see. In the black. I feel like the white one looks more French. Do it. What do you think? I just say I like black. I'm a plain guy. A plain guy? I'm a plain guy. But the white one is sweet too. Can I get the white one? Can we see that one? The white one? <laughs> We're being super extra. Okay, you hold it and hold the black one too. Put them up. And let me see. Put them up. What else? No, like an umbrella. <laughs> Not like your titties. Hello. And the red. And the red. <laughs> what, what else do you want? <laughs> oh. <laughs> we have all the color you like. Who freaking goes to the market with no cash? Use all our euros in it. Yeah, no more euros. So now we have to just figure out how to pay for stuff. Hmm? <laughs> All right, I'm getting delirious. <laughs> the Uber here takes a million years Four and years. we decided to get out of the Uber. We were there for like an hour and it's only one mile away, but it just kept driving us in loop, circles loop, and loop. circles and circles. So we're walking now. Hey, but we met some Orange County people. Some Orange County people from LA. That was cool. Connection. Let's go. Let's not get lost. I don't have time. I gotta get back to sing to go to my show. Apparently there's some sort of strike going on, so a lot of roads are closed down, so that's why it's really hard to get around. The Ubers were stuck and our flights were canceled yesterday. We were supposed to be here yesterday, but we were canceled, so we had to come in a day later. And here we are after an hour at our destination. See that big ass snail up there? Super cute. Les Escargo. We finally made it. How you feeling, Vin? Oh, feeling good. It's worth that running. My armpits are all going out. All right, here we go. Let's look at the menu. Snails served in a variety of ways. We need that water after that long walk. This is a sparkling water because I need that gas and we're having some wine as well. The Bordeaux. The Bordeaux. Yes, 2008, Santé Milieu. 2008? Okay. Yeah, All right. Good Thank, you. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you. A closer look at the Chateau Gibille, 2008. He said it's very, very good, and I agree. How about Me you? Too. Vin had to run here. His big butt was way behind, 
and he was running while I was walking. <laughs> How can the short girl, like the shortest, and just walks through it, and I'm just like, <gasps> I had to like run at least a good quarter mile, and she just came in like five minutes after. Me. I was like, ah, not enough, long break. <laughs> First of all, <laughs> I'm not short. You're fun size. Thank you. That's what I thought. I powered walked here, and my brother ran here. And I still beat him. Cheers to that. Yes. To Paris. Here is the 36 choices, right? 36 escargot, different flavors. And we got some bread underneath. Okay, you're a, you're a garlic snail. Okay. Uh huh. A truffle snail, truffle uh, butter. Okay. And a uh, fry grass. And very important to finish with a garlic snail, okay? Because it's strong. Yes, okay. strong. The first is more good fry grass, truffle, garlic. So go clockwise. Yes. Okay. Uh, you know. Thank you. You're welcome. Enjoy your meal. Maxi. This is how you uh, get the snails. You grab it with this. Oh. And then Delicious. you bring it to your plate. Like that. Okay, okay. Like that. My, my. Thank you. Alright. Dress it up too. You want some, Mr. Kiwa? Yes. Yummies. <laughs> okay. Yummies. He's sleeping right now because it's it's uh, morning over there, so he, I just woke him up. Okay, good night, babe. I think I like the traditional one, which is the one right here. It's just basically butter, garlic, and um, parsley. And which one do you like the best? I like all the flavors. Oh my god. I just love Paris. I'm coming back. We need, We gotta get us a lock. We gotta get us a lock, and then we gotta go to the lock. And then I will lock it up, and then whenever I have a... Uh, Girlfriend? No, a fiance. I'll bring her to Paris like, you and have opened up my lock. I'm sorry to burst your bubble, but we you should have done your research, but the bridge is no longer there. They're getting rid of it. They got rid of it? Yeah. We they got about, rid of it. I just saw somebody Instagram it yesterday. Are you sure? Yeah. I could have sworn they said they cleaned it up. Somebody got locked somewhere. Okay, let's find out. Ask, ask the waiter. Did you know that Paris, France is the most awarded Michelin stars in the U.S., in the world? They have the most uh, Michelin awards. What does that mean? That means what like Michelin? they... Uh, Michelin is like one of those... <laughs> one of those things where their food is so good that they get awards for it. So you get like a Michelin star, a stamp on it. That means that restaurant's really legit, right? So that's what I know. But Mr. Kiwo told me that Michelin star is the freaking Michelin man from the yeah. entire that's show. Very good. That's what I was about to say. Like, no. <laughs> you get that down, then you're good at that car. No, 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 no. Um, we will find out. Let's Google it and see what the Michelin star means. I really don't know. But I just know that France, Paris, is the area where has where most restaurants have the most Michelin stars. In our family, we like to keep one piece left and it just shows, you know, courtesy. Is it respect? Yeah, it's all courtesy. courtesy and honor, respect. Yeah, so go ahead. You get the last piece. Go ahead. Please. Go ahead. I already got it. Go ahead and see. <laughs> I, 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 went, I mean, I went all this piece right here. I'm full. Go ahead. You went like right here. Oh my goodness. <laughs> I'm full too, so even though we're full, after you eat this piece, we're going to another restaurant! So apparently Mr. Kiwa was right. The Michelin Guide rating system is for the Michelin star. <laughs> oh my goodness, what? What, what, what? See a line? You get in. Okay, here we go. <laughs> I have my brother here standing in line for me. And he wants to ask me for an opinion about Olivia and Evelyn's clothing. He wants to buy them some presents. Let's see. I think this one's cute. I'm not sure if Lynn will like this one. I always have to consider Lynn because she doesn't like colors and shapes and all that stuff. Let's look up something else. So we have to hold each other's spaces. All right, Vin, you gonna go pay for it? Yeah. All right, let me hold the space. Go. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, good. <laughs> go pay for it. Go get it. Go get it, dog. Get that 30% off. Three to six months, right? Three to six months for Evelyn? Evelyn. Uh, how old is she now? She's about like two months old. Yes, three to six. There you go. Get it. So here's the menu. We're going to get the ravioli right here. That looks good. I'm not thinking about the caviar. You got your caviar? stuff together? Yeah, I got it. All right, let's 
Let's do this. So let's see what you got, Miss Olivia Ang and Evelyn Ang. Oh damn, dog. What did you choose? Oh, it's like it's like it's already a present right there. Son. Okay, okay. So you don't. Okay, we, I chose this one by the way, Lynn. Just to let you know. And then Vin chose this one for Olivia. Open that up. This one. Now. Ooh. I'll surprise you. Let him surprise you. This is the cute menu with the duck on it. Um, this place, uh, this is the restaurant. I'm not even gonna try to pronounce it, but this is what it is. Starting off with wine again. The whisper wine. This guy's gonna hook us up. Yeah, he recommended. He's like, it's good. It's really good. It's the best. This is the best. This is the best. Okay, good. It's a little sour, but it's okay. Let it brew in 2012. Okay. okay. In 10 minutes, you will, you will see. Yeah, let okay. it Okay. Thank you. Exactly. Okay, cheers. Me and my brother. Yes. For being in France. Yes. In first time. France. Cheers. <laughs> Here we have our food. There you go. So uh, this is the... Ooh, caviar. the caviar. Okay, this is Vin's first time having caviar. Yes. We are going fancy. to... You fancy, huh? Exactly. You fancy. Okay. I treat my uh, family well. Oh yeah, I did. Yeah, she does. The caviar. Wow. This is the first time my brother's having caviar. I want to treat him, make it very nice, good experience. And this is, I think this is how you do it, okay? I think. So you grab the um, bread here. Get a little bit of that caviar on here. Just a little bit, because this is a pricey. This is a pretty penny. What is it, like 70 something? And then you get a little bit of this. This cream right here. And then you just enjoy it. Wow. Caviar. Try it out, let me know. What do you think? Mm. How is it? Your first time having caviar, Milky. how is it? Milky. Milky? Milky. Is it worth it? I don't know about $70, but fine. Do it. Do it, okay. More wine. Okay, okay. We are gonna be fancy today. Look at that, caviar. And uh, my brother thinks it's okay. Rude. It's okay. This or the escargot? This. This? I don't know, you can't, you can't do that. You can't do that. What's better, what's better? Like, let me have both. All right, let's try it out and see if it's worthy. You know, what is it? The pancake is a little bit thick for me, but Why you flavors are good. Flavors are good. It you should be crackers. crackers. Honestly, yeah. it should be crackers. Really? Mm -hmm. Me and my brother so full. We we couldn't finish right. this caviar. We're we're giving it away. We're giving it away. Is it good? Caviar. Is it good? Yeah. Let me know if you want more. Yeah, we here. We got you sure? It. It's okay. Really? Yeah. You know what he said? He said it's, it's okay. It's alright. It's, it's because right. I, you know what I mean? I, Excuse you know me? I mean? This guy, <laughs> he said it's blasphemy if it's spicy. Yeah. <laughs> what? <laughs> Why can't I have the Thai chili peppers? <laughs> he said this is the best. This is the best that you can have. Alright, we'll, we'll let everybody wow. hear it down you. This is the uh, ravioli fogua. We are too full. We're sharing with everyone here that we just met. Yay! Yeah. So after sharing this to everyone, I finally taste it and oh my god, it is orgasmic in your mouth. It's bomb, dude. Delicious. Me and Vin are completely stuffed to the fullest, oh, like yeah. a stuffed turkey good. on Thanksgiving night. It's good. And we are just gonna walk it off the and look for some more sceneries for him to take photos for. Yeah. Okay? Oh yeah. Get go. Get go. I just wanna get this on record that this guy right here. Recommended me the best fogwa in the world. The best. Of if the not, best. I will come for him. The best. Or the spirits will come for him. Or okay? her spirit. That's worse of her spirit. Huh? It's the best. He's for friends. I trust you. I trust you. Best fogwa. He said, but there's no good. But there's no good. Get out of here. After our rendezvous at the uh, cafe the and restaurant, we are heading back to the hotel. Yeah. What are your thoughts, Vin? Yo, it was bomb. Good people, good place, better fucking atmosphere. I love it here. Just chilling like I a villain. I need to be here. 24. Yes, we were having fun and just getting to know a lot of people and uh, 
good to open up and uh, be Indiana Cafe. In the what? Indiana Cafe. Indiana Cafe. How about we go to La Spicy? Okay, spicy. A La Spicy home bar and All cocktails. Right. Let's go. Let's go. In Paris, people like Where? to stare at people and watch while we, people pass by. So we're gonna sit here and do the same thing what people do. Me and my brother right here are gonna take a break. We're gonna have some coffee, espresso, wake up, because I gotta go sing, you know? And we're gonna order something close to home, which is onion soup like a pho, right there. Let's take our espresso and last all night long. Espresso time. <laughs> Mm. They gave us a piece of chocolate with our thing, with our espresso always, but we never use it. So maybe this time we should try something new and use it. This is a piece of sugar, and I think it's intended for the coffee, as you can see right there. We're gonna put it in our coffee right here, let it melt because it's nice and hot. Chocolate. And they also the give you sugar. That's crazy. French style. This is um from the restaurant. It's called. Secret Daddy. Let's get the Secret Daddy in my cafe. This is the first time that I actually put sugar and coffee into my coffee and we're gonna try something new and see how it goes. Cheers. Mm, it is, it's a little sweet, but for my taste, I like it straight up because I'm a monster. It's awesome. It's tasty. After we finish this espresso, we're gonna go back to the hotel and I gotta go back to uh, singing. I'm gonna do my face. Did you know this is not kale, right? Okay. Not kale. Put on my face. Not kale. Then. Yeah, I'll put on my face. Vin's gonna dish me. <laughs> Vin's gonna dish me to have some fun. And I'm gonna go hang out with you and show you a great time at my show. Oh yeah, got chocolate though. We're gonna have the uh, pho soup. Oh, the, the fire. I know, fire. With the uh, mushrooms and we have foie gras here. Treat oh, my brother pain. out. Little brother. Choo, choo, choo. What did you think of that pho soup? It's no good. No good? Why? Don't taste good. Is it because it's not authentic Vietnamese pho? The French invaded us, but they didn't invade the whole damn thing. They didn't take everything from us. Basically, it's a little bit sour and it's not quite pho, but we will just appreciate and enjoy. More like Ming, 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 um, uh, what is it? Mushroom, how do you say mushroom in Vietnamese? Ming, um, no, it's not nep. Ming, uh, nam? Yeah, Ming, nam. We're running short on time. We're gonna take this pate to go and just enjoy it on the road. I gotta go sing. Gotta go sing. Heading out right now. Let's go back home. And by the way, in Paris, people like to sit and like watch other people, which is a nice thing because you get to know and sense what the community is about. We didn't get a chance to check out the Notre Dame, but here it is right here in the Uber. Yes. This is a drive-by scenery kind of thing. All right, you got your pictures? Got everything? Okay, we gotta go home now. <laughs> okay, I gotta go home because I gotta uh, go, go sing. Yes, let's go. Oh my god, did we make it back in time? Just like right in the nick of time. All right, five. Hallelujah, Vin. Hallelujah. All right, so now I'm gonna head to the uh, event center and Vin's going to ditch me. We are going to the event center. No, you're not. You're gonna ditch me for some girls. <laughs> This is where me and my brother split off. He's gonna chill here for a moment, hang out and relax while I have to go grind. And uh, we'll meet up later. Let's just hope he doesn't get lost, okay? Cross fingers, he will meet me back at the right time he said he would. Which is? Seven o'clock. No, then 12 a.m. if you're gonna go somewhere else. 12 a.m.? Yeah, at the event center. Oh, that's when you perform? Yeah. I'm letting you do whatever you want for the rest of the day. <laughs> Bad boy. Brother's gonna load it up, and this is where we part, Vin. Bye, Vin. Toodles. Don't get too crazy now. I'll leave you behind. I think this is my luggage. Let's check it. Yes, it is my luggage. And heading into the hall center. Check it out. Get my makeup on, rehearse with the band, and prepare for the show. Ooh, look at that. All fancy. Looks all legit. Hey, 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 looks like dinner. 
this way hi Jay. and let me show you the stage I think somebody's rehearsing let's find out this is the sound guy hi they're practicing right now hi Ann. elevator down to the floor where we get ready, put our faces on, etc, etc, etc. So we went the wrong way. We're going to have to find another way down. Okay, so there's no way down. I think I'm just going to use my muscles because I'm a monster. Hi, Ju. You still can do it? <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> Thank you. He just hooked me up. All right, restroom, and I'm assuming this is the backstage. Let's find some room to relax, put my luggage. Oh my goodness. Where, 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 where? Maybe it's in here. Yes. Joko. Joju. John. Okay, so it looks like everybody claimed a room already, so I'm going to just hang out in the community area right here. This is my dressing room. I'm going to get ready, put my face on, and show is going to start in about two hours, they say, but honestly, it's probably three. Hi. Hi, how are you? Station is all set up, ready to rock and roll. This whole space is mine. I claimed it. You got your personal room? This whole space is mine. Okay, makeup ready. Clothes is ready. Ready to rock and roll. Let's go upstairs. I think I'm still a little bit early. Let's check the audience. We got some people in here. Here and there. I think we might start a little bit, a little bit late. I'm the first person up and we're gonna rock and roll tonight. Let's do this. Chúng tôi muốn gửi đến quý vị giọng hát trẻ trung nhất trong ngày hôm nay nhưng sẽ lại là một giọng hát sẽ làm cho khối động chương trình để cho được uh, thật là một cái không khí vui tươi đến quý vị phần trình diễn của nữ ca sĩ Anh Minh. Thank you, Jimmy. I mean, sorry, I'm so thank you, Jimmy. Love. Jimmy, I'm so happy to chào tất cả quý vị trong ngày hôm nay và Anh Minh là hình như là hai ba năm này không có trở về Paris hôm nay trở về thấy quý vị đông đủ và rất là dễ thương thì anh xin là hát một bài song ca với một nam ca sĩ người Hàn Quốc đây quý vị có biết ai không quý vị ơi đang nghe là anh Minh xin mời hát song ca đi đại nguyện quý vị có biết ai không là Oh, my God. 
It is the end of the night, 12.43 a.m. and I just finished my second set. I'm starting to feel the exhaustion right now and I'm going to call it a night. See you guys tomorrow. Um, it's going to be a long, long trip to Germany. So hopefully I'll see you guys out there. Okay, so before I go, I just want to say I'm super, super sorry. My apologies for calling Jun Nam Lao Jun Yan. Um, I don't know what I was thinking. Originally, Jun Yan was supposed to be in the show, but he um, had to pull out last minute because he got a artery like in his nose and it just like popped a vein. So it kept bleeding and it was due to high blood pressure, you said? Yeah. High blood pressure. So he had to pull out last minute and replaced him with Jun Nam Lo. So I just saw Jun Nam Lo for a split second and maybe I wasn't sleeping and my brain wasn't working, but I feel so bad. So sorry. All right. Anyway, um, now I'm going to go. It's going to be a long drive. So I'll see you How guys. How many hours? Seven hours. Wait, I thought it got, I thought it was like, I just said it was like 10 hours. Alright, we're prepared, ready. I just wiped off all my makeup, my mask, the bus even and ready to sleep. Seriously. <laughs> Alright, roll out, roll out. It's the end of the night. Oh my god. Got my personal, personal chauffeur. This is awesome.
both of them. Let's get on this bus. Go on this seven hour ride. Actually ten with bathroom breaks and such. Hello. <laughs> oh. Excuse me. Excuse me. Excuse me. It's food. Oh yeah, dog. We got the back of the bus. Move out, move out, move out, move out. <laughs> yeah. Ooh. You snooze, you lose, Dan. You snooze, you lose. Bye, Felicia. Two o'clock in the morning and we are settled in on the bus. Yeah. Gonna get some food. Green Let's see what we got, got in our goodie bag. This is a goodie bag that everyone received. Let's see what we get. Uh, we got some uh, instant noodles. Okay, okay. We got some something good. And then we got some uh, water. And then next up we got some chaps. And then next time we have oranges. And then what what else? What what else is in this goodie bag? Um this looks like a muffin or something. It looks like a muffin. And then dude, I think this is soup. Is that soup? Alright, this is soup. Ooh, and then we got a salad de frizz. We're gonna find out what the salad de fris is. Oh, the salad de fruits, I see. Not fris. <laughs> salad de fruit. And then what is that? What is that? Is that soup? Mm -hmm. Oh, it's chow, dog. Where's the uh? Damn. Vin had a great night out. Yeah. Check out his vlog. Yeah. Obviously, he ditched me for something better. <laughs> Which is vacation and wanderlust. <laughs> yes, I uh, was roaming. Yes, I told him to come back at 12, he came back at 1. Misbehaving. 1.30. <laughs> Misbehaving. And so... But we are here. Yes. Show is done. We're heading out to... Um, Germany. Oldenburg, Germany. Oldenburg. It's going to be a 7 hour trip. And yeah. it's probably going to be a little longer because we want to stop for restrooms and all yeah. such and such and such. such. And uh, some food, I suppose. And then um, from there, we are going to sing right away. So we need some sleep ASAP. What you like uh, for? You not singing? I just gotta see you guys do go through it. Ugh. It's awesome. I can't even deal. Do it live. All right, so let's get some sleep. Let's get some real good sleep. Cause I don't want to call Junam Lok Junya again. Lost of sleep. Lost of sleep. And uh, my apologies again. Oh my god. Anyway, also, I hope Junyan gets better. Time flies, so you just gotta really appreciate life and, you know, hope for the best. And I hope that he gets out of this um, hospital and the stroke from the stroke that he had. I hope that he gets much better. He gets well soon and get out of this. Speedy recovery. Yes, the hospital. Uh, wishing for a speedy recovery and hope to see him soon. Will be in our prayers. By the way, we have some red chili peppers that Dan's gonna hook me up with. Yeah, All right, dog. Um, and this bus is equipped with a microwave. This is high quality stuff. Yeah, I feel like Beyonce. <laughs> Ooh, check that out. Fire. Yeah, fire, baby. I'm fire, for baby. You. Where's the lemon? Huh? No lemon. Ah. I said I'm Beyonce. Did you not hear what I said? <laughs> Ooh. Is this the um, Frenchman me or Vietnamese? Uh, so what <laughs> <laughs> okay, cool. We got some bun me right here. How's it? Long, long, man. Is it good? It's like the sea, right? Okay, so mine is in the microwave right now. Getting all heated up. Legit. Dude, this is ready. Ready to eat. Yes, Jiao. And we got some bun mi right there, too. Yeah. It's legit. <laughs> this is the real life. Real singer's life. Bon appetit. Just be happy to be alive. Be happy to be able to do this. And just be happy to travel the world.